It's the size of the state of Delaware, and it's just broken away from Antarctica. The one trillion ton iceberg, one of the biggest on record, carved away from the Larsen Sea ice shelf sometime between July the 10th and 12th. But it's no surprise, having been close to breaking off for a few months. This could be just the beginning though, according to Edward King from the British Antarctic Survey. There have been a lot of changes in the Antarctic Peninsula where the Larsen Sea is located. Uh, because temperatures there have risen faster than anywhere else in Antarctica. So it's a location that we need to monitor and we need to be looking at the satellite data that have told us this iceberg has, has disappeared. We need to be getting boots on the ground to really understand what is happening in this quite fast changing region. Scientists use satellites to monitor the progress of the rift in the ice shelf throughout the Antarctic winter. It could now pose a risk to passing ships. The huge runaway, likely to be named A68, was already floating before it broke free. That means there's no immediate impact on sea levels. But the calving has reduced the Larsen Sea ice shelf by more than 12%. There are fears that further breaking away of ice shelves could cause the glaciers that feed them to melt causing sea levels to rise enormously.